Hey there, this is Dan with a quick video about the checkout widget and a new feature that we have added. Now, as you know, in the checkout widget, you can pre-select what products you'll be selling. And now we have added this new feature where when you select more than one product, you now have the option to allow the customers to choose which of the pre-selected products they can purchase. So this is very cool for selling different types of products in single checkout widget and you can also have different options such as maybe having products uh, you know purchasing products for bigger amount uh, at a discounted price so you can create a few different products as bulk where they can purchase and as you can see they can pre-select which of the options they can purchase this is really also very cool if you have a product that a person can buy for a single purchase or on installments. So you can do that by here we created a membership which is three payments for $29. This is basically a recurring payment happening for three months or you can purchase it right away. So if somebody cannot afford it right away, the full amount, they can just make it an installment. So it's really easy and fast way to do so. So how do you create this type of installments? You can do in go into the store go to products and here we created this membership for three payments. Now any product you can make on installments by selecting the subscription product and selecting for example how many times you want to build them, if it's ongoing as a subscription and what is the cycle basically every week, every month, every few months, every weeks. So this is it. This is how simple it is to do that and yeah the checkout widget is really powerful now in allowing you to do this type of um, options for your customers and you can also change the view of your of your widget of course you can do it with the summary as the normal like e-commerce type of a checkout if you go here you can actually show the order summary and you have that you have the option now for having it as, as this type of a view and again you have the options with the images and again they can pre-select what kind of a product they will be purchasing in this view as well or again, you can go to the normal checkout flow. So this is it. This is how easy it is to create product options for person to purchase uh, upon checkout in your checkout funnels or pages in general. Okay, I hope that you enjoyed it and looking forward to the next video.